Well, Don, you know this year we've tried a lot of whiskeys that have been aged in different things from, from tea to wine to honey. But for the holidays, I thought we'd get something special. Just when I thought I'd seen everything, a bourbon with frankincense and myrrh. Perfect for Christmas. Stay tuned. Welcome to this week's edition of What's New at Charlie's. Well, for the holidays, we've got something special. A Boss Hog 10, the 10th edition of the Boss Hog series from Whistlepig. Always, a, always an exciting release, always doing something crazy, and they may have topped themselves this time. My good friend, Mr. Don Williams of Bourbon Fool. Don, what, what have they done? You know what the 10 stands for? The Commandments. The Ten Commandments, yes. They have the Ten Commandments of bourbon, this, of this bottle, or is it just of whiskey in general? Yeah. It, it, it is. They have their commandments, and that's what they call this uh, bottle. Uh-huh. And it is as unique as anything I've ever seen, a whiskey treated with frankincense and myrrh. That's crazy, man. I don't even know where this, I don't even know where this is going to go. But I do know... It's got a really cool package, and it always does. They always yes. do. Yeah, so first of all, it's got the little sliding door here, and then out comes, ta-da, look at that. The pig's got the tablet, dude. He's got the commandment tablet. Yes, absolutely. Every year the pig has something really cool on it. So these are, these are the caps are, are almost worth it alone just to buy it just for that but um frankincense and myrrh huh weird so i had to look that up and it's actually frankincense and myrrh is a tree sap really and it's very rare um a lot of it is native to ethiopia okay and so in biblical days it had an aromatic uh essence to it yeah so it would be used for incense it would be used for perfume uh, it probably had back then medicinal qualities and so it is still very rare very hard to harvest and our friends at whistle pig figured out a way to age their whiskey in a barrel that infuses this frankincense and myrrh i'm going to call it tree resin uh-huh. And then they also finish it in a used mead barrel to give it some berry notes. Okay. And mead is a honey a, a honey based, you know, product that, yeah. you know, is very common which, in a lot of areas. Which was one of the first alcoholic beverages, right? So yeah, back it was. when they were giving frankincense sense and myrrh as a gift they would have had some mead with it maybe well robin hood all, and robin hood and friar tuck yes, would I, have had a uh, glass of mead i think it all goes together well so it does um i guess we should just open it and try it because i don't even know where to go from there we so should. let's see what we got all right that thing weighs about three pounds dude they always do All right, cheers, my friend. Cheers. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Nothing really stands out on the nose for me. Suddenly come to me, I don't know what frankincense or myrrh tastes like. <laughs> If you did, I'd be impressed. Yeah, I know. So I'm just, wow. I, I still don't know what to expect. I do get the mead, though. I do I, get I'm the sweetness. The honey. I'm getting the honey note I totally really get that. strong. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, it is unique. Dude, I think that's great. I love that. I get some of the frankincense, but I'm not really getting the myrrh out of it. <laughs> or maybe I'm getting the myrrh and I don't get the frankincense. I'm not sure which it is, but I'm only getting one. I'm 
But that that's what's what's the proof on that? Isn't that like 100, 106 or something? One hundred six, right about. Yeah, that's, right dude, about that, that. That is easy drinking. It's uh, it is smooth. I mean, I like that a lot. It's really different. Really different, as you would expect. Yeah. So you have to you have to tell everyone what their tagline is. This. Well, yeah, I mean, this is a bourbon or a whiskey of biblical proportions. And it has a biblical price. <laughs> it sure does. <laughs> yes. It's quite expensive, but um, this might just be worth it Yeah, for me. So as it opens up a little bit, yeah. I'm getting a lot more on the nose. The myrrh or the <laughs> frankincense? <laughs> We're going to lose what audience we have. That's you know, definitely really the myrrh. Are. Definitely the myrrh. Definitely the myrrh. Yeah. All kidding aside, I think that's a great that's a great pour right there. Yeah, that's something something you're not gonna find anywhere else, that's for sure. So if you're looking for a treat for yourself at the holidays, this is it. Absolutely. Because you'll be able to tell everybody you had some whiskey treated with frankincense and myrrh. And me. And me. Charlie? Happy holidays, my Happy friend. Happy holidays. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, guys. Merry Christmas and happy holidays from everyone here at Charlie's and from the Bourbon Fold. Thank you for watching our videos and have a safe holiday season.